so now we will going to see the elements of the dimensioning uh, dimension elements are uh, this is surface finish symbol and uh, this is actual profile and uh, this is the circle that is in between circle and it's a uh, diameter is represented with this symbol and these are the projection lines uh, it is not the actual profile so these projection lines we have to indicate with the thick line sorry thin line uh, and uh, this profile whatever it is square is there it is represented with the uh, thicker one and uh, this this is the dimension figure and uh, this is the dimension line this is also these are projection lines projection lines and this is the dimension line uh, this to be uh, thin lines and uh, profile should be of a thick lines these are the arrow arrow we need to indicate arrows there are different types of the arrows here you can see this is the length uh, of the arrow and this is width it should be a 15 to 90 degree and uh, it, it can be represented with the open close and uh, as well as uh, filled uh, closed and completely filled darkened we can represent uh, dimension systems can be re classified by different different types and uh, different ways it is classified but uh, dimension systems let us see of what is the align system and uh, unidirectional system in align system the dimension which are been represented see, example if you see this 40 this 40 35 65 so 10 and 35 these are represent along with uh, parallel to these lines uh, this line as it is uh, represented in that direction it has been written you can see this one if this is in this direction and uh, uh, 65 is in this direction and 30 is also as well as in this direction and 40 is along to this direction these are the directions which are written parallelly so here it is represented in this manner that's why it is called as aligned dimension system here you can see this along with these lines as the lines I, line direction is there that uh, 30 it is written in that direction only this is called as aligned dimension system here you can see uh, these values are a unidirectional system uh, the direction of these values it is uh, unidirection uni is you can see 65 35 all are represented in the same direction that's why the, uh, you can see here these all are represented in the same direction that's why these are called as a unidirectional uh, system different methods of the dimensions so now let us see uh, there are different methods of the dimensions are the chain dimension parallel dimension combined dimension progressive dimension dimension by coordinates equidistant dimension repeated dimensional one by one let us go to see uh, this is the chain dimension all are represented in the chain as uh, one after another as a chain as chain is having uh, all the placed in in one direction uh, here also same one after another uh, dimensions are placed so that's why it's called as a chain dimension here this is a this is an example of the parallel dimensioning you can see these uh, both the li dimension lines are uh, in a parallel here it, it was in the chain one after another that's why it was called as a chain dimension here these are lines are the parallel that's why these are called as a parallel dimensioning and uh, here you can see combined both these lines are parallel but here this and this are in the chain here this one and this one is in the chain that's why these are called as a chain and these are called as a parallel and here you can see uh, this one is a progressive here uh, from 0 20 uh, 26 it is and here it is a 55 and uh, 68 that is uh, this distance is represent this distance is represented over here and from here to here it is a total once again here represent it is represented you can see 0 to 15 this is from here to here it is 15 but from here to here it is a 28 this method of the representation is nothing but about the progressive dimensioning uh, progressive dimensioning and uh, there is uh, dimensions by coordination that is uh, here it is a dimension by coordinates here only one coordinate is represented that is a zero over here and here 25 65 100 that is that is here to here it is 25 here to here it is 65 here to here it is 100 and here to here it is uh, 135 that's why this method is called as a 
dimension by coordinates it is called as so these are the methods of the dimension representation uh, in next part we are going to see further uh, points please follow the videos for the further information